Yes, welcome to another amazing edition of The Hype. And this week we feature Rhyme Schemes. What up, it's your boy Rhyme Scheme, R.S. Still California driven, man. We rock with Hype TV. Exactly. Let's go. Get familiar with rising hip hop recording artist RS, aka Rhyme Schemes. Rhyme Schemes is originally from Detroit but moved to Los Angeles, California to pursue a career in entertainment. Rhyme Schemes has built a major name for himself while stationed on the East Coast doing massive collaborations with heavyweights such as Keith Mary. Currently promoting his two songs, Paradise and Africa to America, Rhyme Schemes has worked with a few African artists from Tanzania and he's now eyeing on Roberto Zambia. Right, it's just so effortless, never say what I say. Only living a dream, Africa to America. Gotta find my queen. Africa to America. I'm in love with the man. What would your three wishes be if someone could make them come true? Man, three wishes, man. So I feel like a genie or something. But uh, shit, I would bring, I would bring my parents back alive. That'd be number one. Um, but you know, they've been my inspiration in this journey. I've been doing the music and life, so kind of use them as my strength and inspiration. But definitely, I bring them back alive so they can, you know, witness my success, witness my kids being born and stuff like that. Uh, I think second, hmm, three wishes. I might have to build me like a farm in like you know Africa or something like that. That might be the second wish. And uh, shit, the third wish, make Barack Obama president again. <laughs> that would be the third wish. But uh, yeah, those are the three things I can, I can think of offhand, man. Most people probably want money and whatever like that. But if I can bring my peoples back, you know what I'm saying, get some land back in the homeland and uh, get Barack Obama back in office, we'll do that. What do people constantly misunderstand about you? Um, you know, I think I think a lot of people, being a musician, and especially if they meet you off Instagram or whatever, they think that's your only trick. Um, or they may label rappers as like, you know, uneducated or whatever like that. But people don't realize, like, I got four college degrees and I, you know, and travel the world and stuff like that. So one monkey don't stop no show and you only let people see what they want them to see. So that's kind of my thing. You got to get to know me to really know all sides of me. So that's some of the things people misunderstand or get confused. Do you believe in burning bridges when it comes to your exes? Um, no, nah, man, <laughs> you don't want to burn no bridges because you know that's some relationships, period. In general, you don't want to burn no bridges with anybody because you don't know who's going to become who. This world is big, but it's small seven degrees of separation, so you never know who you're going to need or who you're going to know. I would say at the end of the day, just be a good person, you know, be humble. You know, sometimes you're going to meet bad people, you can, you can be nice as you want to be, but. You know, that's the best, do the best you can do. That's how I say, just do the best you can do, you know. But I wouldn't burn no bridge, especially some of them girls, man. They'll put like a, you know, a hex on me or some shit. So, <laughs> we don't need that, man. For real. No, no, but that's it, though. <laughs> how do you feel about a cheating partner? Man, you know what? As I got older, yeah, I, you know, I started knowing right from right from wrong when I got a little bit older. I know when we was young, everybody kind of probably went down that lane a little bit. But, uh. I, you know, I think especially with kids involved, you got a, you got a family and stuff like that. It's kind of like it seems like more portrayal the more older and more established you get, you know, cheating on somebody or stepping out and stuff like that. I know when we was like nineteen, you know, we ain't take it as serious, so we may have like multiple people we talk to. But that's at nineteen. But you know, when you get a little older, you be you experience that you get more established, man. I think that's that's stuff that you go out the window. Is your job now a reflection of what you said you wanted to be as a kid? No, nah, man. No, nah, I wanted to be like, I don't know, a superhero. I wanted to be like uh, Michael Jordan or somebody, like jumping out the gym, you know. But I didn't grow past 5'9", so. <laughs> so I don't know if that's going to, I don't know if that was going to ever help you. But, um, you know, I think I'm at the right place at the right time and doing the right <laughs> stuff, man. So I think that's what's going on right now. So that's it, man. You heard the first baby hype TV. It's your boy Rhyme Scheme. Let's get it. Zambia, stand up. Man, life. Yes, I come white and I fuck up. My love, who let you see your car for a car? Fide papu, she fide chiti komu pamba. Mucharo chesu chino cha Zambia. I feel lo yo aya choma hula. Inemu aya koma hula. Now the Hype TV this week shines a light on Chingola's best up-and-coming rapper, CP the Rap King, whose vision is becoming an international artist from the real ghetto and be a real inspiration to anyone working hard, knowing opportunities are there if you are willing to take.
keep your distance if I see me Love you never get shimmy shimmy shit Mama wadu seko not a big time Advertise or feature on the Hype TV Kindly WhatsApp us on plus 260-964-1849 36 or you can email us at claret3 at gmail.com the hype tv airs exclusively on the claret normal's facebook page so make sure you like follow and share the hype tv feel cool be cool from grace creations is a catering services company with the following on offer platters of all sorts cakes for any event Catering services for birthday parties and many more events at affordable prices. Our services also include gift baskets and picnic setups. For orders or bookings, call or WhatsApp 0962-506617. That is 0962-506617.